Hey, excuse me? I really dig your style. Like, I'm a photographer. I was wondering if I could take a portrait. You got a dope vibe and everything, so. You wanna be, be part of history? You're no? Alright, you look, you seem ready. You look good. I like the quality of life out here. I feel like there's a better balance between nature and city. Every day I'm stimulated by people. Like every day there's a story out here. This is East Hollywood. Yeah, this is East Hollywood. Predominantly Latino, but you have every culture, ethnicity here. And then just different styles from like hippies to gangsters to you know, cowboys, like just everybody's in the mix, so. It's like another little galaxy, like you're just in, so just a postmodern part of LA, like of the world, you know? Let's hear No, I take, I'm gonna take the picture. I never like keeping my camera out on me before I kind of like connect with people. Oh, wow. We'll both, here, let's, yeah, just like that, yeah. There you go, there you go. Yeah, a big aspect to not only photography, but just my mentality is no definitions. Like I don't want someone to size me up and already know a category for me. So I always keep my camera in my backpack just to be even more unassuming. There you go. Now you want a picture with me here though? Yeah. What, what do you want to say? Mm. Dedication, dedication. When I come up to people, I'm coming up as a person. Hey, excuse me, boss. I'm a photographer. I was wondering if I could take a portrait of you. You got a good style. Sure. That's cool. Yeah, just be like that. If the foundation first is humanity and sincerity. Let me get you on this side. Because the sun, the sun. Yeah, you can just be right, be right here. I think that transcends to help get a deeper photo. Right, I'm going to take a couple pics. Yeah, go for it. You can look at me. Look at me. Yeah, uh, take my email, I'll send you, I'll send you the pic. Right. What's your name? Eduardo. Oh, Eduardo? Yeah. Sean. Sean Thank you, man, I appreciate you. I'm from LA. So if someone's like trying to flex or trying to be extravagant in the street or on the bus, I'll take that pic. Uh, but most of the time, if it's someone that's kind of calm or just chilling, like I don't, I usually ask. Hey, we're doing a little movie. Anybody want to be in it? Shoot? No? We'll get you right here, like. It's like representing, like that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and take my email, I'll send it to you. Okay, yeah. You want a photo? Want a photo? Uh, all right. I don't want to be known as like some dude that's making people angry because I'm taking their photo without permission. No, this approach is universal, whether it's New York or whether it's like Idaho or a small town or a big city. You want me to, you want me to send it to you? Get as enviarlo? No, no, stop it. All right. I've gone all over and taken photos and um, never have had an issue because it's always been out of just love and respect. Oh, yo, yo soy una photographer sobre como la moda, la como la cultura, and eres como con la, la makeup, es bonita, yo quiero sacar un photo, de tú. I'm a part of this photo, but 80% of this photo is, is the person that I'm taking the photo of. Oh, here we go. Go ahead, go ahead. No, you're so beautiful, I wanted to get you for the... Thank you. Yeah. So I guess I believe in giving them the power to compose themselves that they, however they want to compose themselves to get the photo they want to get. I hang out with my boyfriend, so we want to eat, so okay. he's waiting for me. Hi. Let's, all right, so let's get you like that, yeah. Go, go. Go ahead. Let's do one right here. And then could I get one of you in the car? Just with your window? No, like, 
Just roll down, I'm gonna get like okay. the, yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. You want me to send you the pics? Yes. Okay. You have uh, take my email. Okay. Thank you so much. Right. Have a good night. Bye bye. I might not have a quote unquote right. candid street photo, but these photos are all born from me on the street, walking on the street, talking on the street, taking pics in the street. I just want to get deeper with it and show some more conceptual projects that come from the street. Another project I did was about dudes that had pigeon coops on the roof in Bushwick. And I just was seeing all these dudes like with pigeons while I was out taking pictures in the street. So I just called up to a dude that was on the roof. Hey, could I come up and take pictures? That created a whole concept of pigeon ownership in Bushwick. When you make a connection with someone and you spend some time with someone, those candid photos will naturally appear. <laughs> Another thing was barbershops. Barbershops like in Brooklyn. That came from me just walking around the neighborhood and seeing the, how vibrant the barbershops were in the neighborhood and taking it from there. I picked up a camera probably, I was probably around like 22, 21, and I would just hop on my bike, hop on my bus, and I've always just been inspired by like people and place. And LA has so many different neighborhoods, so many different places, so many different people. This camera was like a, a reason for me to get out and just make connections with people. And so I came up just kind of like going everywhere, West Side, South Central, East LA, downtown. Yeah, it's just timeless in here. This is just another spot where it's all just real independent businesses. Gotta get an LA hat. Even before I picked up a camera, I think LA and the neighborhoods I lived in, there was just this sense of multiculturalism. I'm mixed myself and just diversity on the street, diversity in my schools. I'm half Irish and half East Indian, and my dad is an immigrant from Burma. So just within my own family, I might be at functions with some random, like, raucous, like, Irish-American people, but then next weekend I'm with a bunch of, like, Muslim Indians and Pakistanis that are completely different. You know, I might have one side of my family that's wearing, like, those like uh, shirts with like wolves on them and talking about guns. And the next week I'm, you know, in a very like whatever Indian or Pakistani type of environment. And that's just within the family. And then even like, like the block I grew up on, like my mom let me play on the street. I was out on the street with a lot of different people. And I, I think that lends a lot to just me as a photographer, I'm always just interested in the dynamics of a person, just the style, the subculture, the expression. Excuse me? I'm doing a little special where I'm taking photos and you have a beautiful style. I was wondering if I could take a, just like you, like that. Sure. Just be like that, where are you going, where are you going? Just be like that, oh, yeah. okay. Yeah, yeah, just be like that. Yeah, there you go, one second, one second. Sure, why not? Yeah, just right there. You want me to send it to you or anything? You have email? No, that's okay. That's uh, cool. You just look in. You're on. You're on the prowl. No, I, I was. I'm just pick up this lamp, uh, and I want to see if it works, but I can't find the other part to it. I got you. Cause shit, I don't know. I used to like when I was on tweak, 20, 30 years ago. I used to go, you know, tweaking and mm. finding shit in the yeah. trash. 
So it's been, I don't tweak no more, but it's still like, I like to, you know, do that. To rum it, to, to rum. No, but I don't do the other. Yeah. I, instead, I take hey, vitamins. It's all good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, good luck. There's nothing wrong with it. Yeah, it's I'm not still, sure. I'm, I'm cool with um, my daughter smoking weed and everything. I don't care what other people do. Yeah. That's their business. Yeah. And I'm not judging anybody. Me too. As long as you're not hurting anybody. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm not the, the, the creator to, to judge. No. Because I don't call him God. I call him the creator. So. That's 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 nice weird. That's why I have like my bracelet things. That's on. what kind of attracted me to. Yeah, you. I have my. These are against for evil and stuff. Uh huh. And I have it in my room. Uh huh. Yeah, I'm I'm with that stuff. I'm weird. I always was a hippie anyway. When I was 13, I ran away from San to San Francisco, so yeah. that tells you something. Let me get one more. You standing right there with the... Oh, okay. Yeah, just right there, right there. Yeah, on the corner. There you go. Just be straight. Be like it's like a... Yeah. Well, not, you know, like as in just be like a little more cool. Like, yeah. There you go. Thank you so Perfect. much. All right. Yeah, then yeah. bye. Bye-bye. Yeah. If that same dude is in there, we could uh, see if he's in there. Here you go. Yeah. My friend. No, no, okay. I can not wait for that. At the time I was 24, and I was, I've always just like romanticized New York. And I had the opportunity to do a program called AmeriCorps. I was a teacher. I taught adults GD and ESL. In the same time though, when I had some free time, number I still four. was shooting. You've been number four. Okay. I did a whole project on these peep shows. It's like it's a bigger culture in New York off 42nd and 8th near the Port Authority, but we have them here in LA too. That just started for me roaming down those streets and taking pictures. And then from there, I made that connection. Like, I want to build upon this. Just put on the, vi if it's cool, video. Yeah. What, what kind of video? You get a video. Yeah, just something nice. Yeah. yeah. So, this is, do I, should I put this Straight light on? Straight or gay? Uh, just whatever is a good one. Okay, cool. And I would just kind of shoot people that were hanging out in these spots or cruising or hustling. Just people being kind of sexual and seedy in these kind of rooms. The kind of vibe and intensity that comes with it, I wanted to document that. If someone doesn't like it, especially from like the, the sexuality standpoint, you know, they'll just not look at it. There's so much porn and sex all around us. On People know either like, I'm just gonna tune it out or I'm gonna check it out can't control how someone interprets it, if it's a positive, if it's a negative, if it's, you know, hopefully it's a visual image that stimulates conversation, that stimulates imagination, and that's on the viewer, though, to how far they want to take it and what they want to think about. This, um, you want to keep it moving outside? It's hard for me to really, like, concentrate at this point. Hopefully when people look at my photo, they, they can have a feeling about it, but they don't know the time period. There's more curiosity, more imagination with it. I gotta get that hat, come on. Oh, he let me have that. I got it. It's all right, take a picture? Really? Yeah, yeah, you're looking good. Look at that with all the um, look like, like with all the spider web. Yeah. Damn, that's nice. Let's go. I take a photo. Yeah. yeah. What's up? What's up? I was at a, a rap show last night, and this rapper, I was backstage, and we were kind of trying to link up to take some photos in the future. He's like, "Oh, that's you." He's like, "I thought you were some cholo dude, or I yeah. thought you, you know, like." And I was like, "Oh, I'm thankful you're using your imagination. That's cool. Like, I hope the next person thinks I'm." whatever like a, a fisherman and the next person thinks i'm like a transgender yeah. uh watchmaker there we go hold that like that just like that hold it like that yeah one second hold it like that 
Stay like that. There you go. Vo yeah, one second, one second. One more. Hold it like that. Hold it like, yeah, yeah. You don't need to know about me. Like, yeah, there you go. Interpret that photo and. One more. If you feel a certain way about that photo, then. All right. Then leave Thank it you. at that. Yeah, you going to tempo? No, I don't know. Is this a gay bar? Yeah. I'm not gay, you know? I'm a, I'm a whore. Oh, yes. oh <laughs> hey! All right, all right. Let's take a picture with you. Come on. All right. If it's dope, it's dope. Here we go. Here, let's, let's say what's up. There you go. Shout out, shout out. <laughs> Look at, oh, 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 oh. I got to get some photos All right. Hey, get it. Oh, yeah. What's up, what's up? Oh, guapo. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Look at him. <laughs> No, I was kidding. Yeah. <laughs> we're at this club called Tempo, and we're in East Hollywood. It's predominantly um, gay Latino cowboys that kind of come through, but it could be anybody. You know, it's an inclusive club. Excuse me? Uh, I'm a fashion photographer. Yo soy una moda de photographer. Puedo sacar un foto? Uh, it's just bueno moda, bueno moda. People's style was just off the hook. Like, the shirts, the boots, the belt, like... So much color, so much style to it. Con, like, it's bueno, it's bueno moda. Not, not right now. Not right now? What about you? Oh, yeah, look at that. I've spent some time just showcasing the, the energy and beauty at this spot. I would take pics like for uh, on a Sunday and then maybe a week or two later come back with the prints. Just get my name out there, just let, you know, let people know I'm serious and that I'm... And I went with the hat, with that. Yeah, right. You know, willing to also give back the photos I took, and I think that created a good vibe in where people knew who I was and they knew I was taking this club and this culture seriously. Muchas <laughs> gracias. Thank you. Thank you. You're not, not you? Together? Juntos? Um, what are you going to do with the picture? I can send it. You want it? What's your email? Your puedo en VR. Uh, one photo in particular that was really deep was of this couple, and um, they're both embracing each other, and one one man is kissing the other man on the cheek. And uh, I think you know, in that photo, you could just feel the sincerity and love, and that was one of my favorite photos. I didn't think twice. Like I was like, this is a really beautiful theme and concept, and culture and like I want to showcase this no matter what I am that that, that has nothing to do with the, the fact that it's going to be a beautiful piece of work yeah. beautiful photos right here okay that's, cool that's my email I'll send it to you all right thank you guys all right thanks thank you, thank you. Thank you. I actually ran it I shot the whole roll right now so hi huh Oh, we're calling. No, we're calling. We're calling Aya. Yeah.